Hello, you guys. How are you guys doing? I hope you guys are doing amazing. We're going to get right into this, you guys. You know your story. Leave it where it be if it's not for you, okay? Leave it where it be if it's not for you. Get y'all a little clean, too. I'm keeping keep you in sage. Sage could be significant. Sage, shit, somebody cleans their energy. Somebody, somebody could have been like energy harvesting off of you because they know how abundant you are, honey. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, it is what it is. Cleanse your energy. Return that shit back to symbol. Transmute it, whatever it is that you do. We got spiritual leader though. This was on the floor. I haven't used these little papers in, you know, at least a couple months. So maybe even a year. I don't know. But yeah. So this could be somebody that's been energy harvesting off of you for the last couple of months or to a year. Where somebody's been watching you secretly. It could be a spiritual leader or you are a spiritual leader. something on their spiritual leader a wealthy man and concern a spiritual leader a wealthy man and concern somebody's concerned about you mastering something somebody's concerned about your wealth yeah somebody's concerned about your wealth and your money because someone is trying to energy harvest off of you because they know how abundant you are. Somebody's just concerned about your wealth. 333. Somebody need to make better decisions or some, some decision was made. What was the decision? What is that? Yeah, you being held in high honor. And a community is in despair. A community, community is in despair because of the work they did. On your wealth, courthouse. It could be some legal issue. Something legal could be going on. Somebody may got a message. Somebody got some information. Somebody know the truth about a theft. A a mature man may want to. Travel to towards a, a privileged lady and partner up with you. Yeah, because uh, I guess this group, a community secret society, this man could be in a cult, a spiritual leader. I don't know if he's being banished or somebody's being banished, like, or, uh, you know, what is the guy when they, when they, they relieving their ass from duty. Whatever that is. Somebody could be like in the military or something. I don't know. But yeah, somebody, this community is in despair because of what somebody said. Yeah, so somebody could have contracted this community to, to block somebody's wealth. To block somebody's money. to block whatever you were creating. Somebody wanted to block. Somebody did some crown chakra work too on somebody to try to block them from being like having passion or being passionate or whatever that is. Spiritual legal. Give me something on the spiritual legal. Spirit. Look, I told you. He's been casted away. The spiritual leader is being casted away. Somebody. The spiritual leader is being casted away. Because they, they feel like a failure. Because there's some evidence that somebody is lying. Or somebody was pretending to be a spiritual leader. Somebody 
somebody was lying about an accident, an injury. So somebody could collab with them to curse somebody to have misfortune. Yeah, but somebody realizing something about you being good or your goodness and somebody was trying to bully you. They thought that would be a good idea to mess with your stability and cause you vision problems in private. An online community was designed for you to be at their mercy but you went in another direction. Adventure here, you went in another direction and started loving on yourself. Mm. So they thought they were gonna, they thought that you were gonna like basically bend over backwards for them and you would join their organization here and they were going to energy harvest off of you use you act like they were like your soul family or your tribe or your friends whatever part of this group you hear me but you were not going to be they were going to energy harvest off of you but now this whole group is in despair because they got to look they were taught you hear me they in despair they feel obligated yeah they in despair i'm telling you because they were dependent on you, but you healed yourself. You healed yourself by yourself. You hear me? They felt obligated and excessively, like, was trying to shoot or project, like, negative energy onto you. They were doing a lot of chaos magic. A lot of crown chakra work. Hmm. But somebody got proof. They went in a sister situation. They realized that you love yourself. Hmm. You're very loving and caring and nurturing or something like that. Somebody could have lied and said that you were dangerous or something like that. But somebody got proof. So you could be a spiritual leader and they were trying to cast you away out of the group. hoping and wishing that's what they were hoping and wishing for look they were doing magic look that's right they were doing magic ceremonies and you found out the mystery here and they were doing this to you know try to get luck and fortune off of you yeah that's gonna drain your energy somebody's still trying to drain your energy give me something on the spiritual leader hmm spiritual leader look you're not pretending and you're not dangerous so like if you you do tarot or you are spiritual or you're guiding people you're head in high honor you got a whole group of people that are literally holding you in high honor but you got a whole group of people that are out here lying and making shit up on you saying that you do underhanded shit you're wearing a mask you're pretending you're lying uh you're dangerous but you're not you're not. This is in reverse. Yeah, somebody says you wore like mini masks. Uh, but somebody, somebody was trying to, somebody they got tripped up. You know, somebody some shoestring. Somebody getting tripped up on the shoestring. Somebody put somebody to the loyalty test. Somebody passed it. Somebody got tripped up. Um, a Capricorn. I mean, I'm seeing Capricorn. Capricorn or devil. Devil. Devil energy. Somebody could have said you were the devil. Somebody found out somebody else was. Devil. Deception. Pretending. What are they? 
inconsistency. So you were supposed to be a devil that was pretending to be good and you were dangerous to caution people to come from coming towards you. Yeah, but some shit done backfired. The Capricorn or the devil got tripped up. Somebody, the devil's shoestring? Somebody could have been using devil's shoestring? Somebody, the devil's shoestring. Devil's shoestring? Um, somebody, some money? What's, what's, somebody, shoestring? Somebody, money tight. Somebody owe somebody like $9,000 or something. Or like somebody, yeah, the online community. The online community try to separate you from your dream. Mm-hmm. Something like that, y'all. Yeah, look. That was the goal to separate you from your eternal love, your love for yourself, your passion. You hear me? But you and your life purpose and your balance. They see that shit. Somebody see it. Somebody got proof. Yeah, somebody's suffering. They wanted you to have like dark memories or they tried to like, I don't know, place memories in your dream state and your subconscious about when you were like, I get, you know, going through trying times or whatever. Somebody wanted you to be suffering just because they were persecuting you. A soulmate. So a soulmate could be having nightmares. So the goal was to, yeah, to, to create a challenge when it comes to um, you having some type of memory loss. Yeah, because somebody wants you to be suffering. But I don't know, somebody wanted you to feel damaged, but they know they lost when they did by doing this magic or whatever because you still learn, you persevere you still uh, developmental developmental disabilities developmental disabilities, that's what the magic was so you would feel lost, damaged, sorrow yeah, something so your mind wouldn't develop and you would be scared suffering And then that's how they could, uh, um, like, connect to you. But you persevered over this challenge. Yeah, and you are in your life purpose as a spiritual teacher, spiritual leader, as a teacher. You're very knowledgeable. Yeah, you give advice. You're very obedient. Yeah, you're stable. You're A-OK. -okay. You accepted whatever the shit they sent your way, and you healed. You moved the hell on. You could have been, like, an introvert. So it brought somebody some type of satisfaction when they separated you, when they put you in isolation. Somebody was trying to put you in isolation. I'm getting like the hermit in reverse. The hermit in reverse. Like they wanted you to have like lack of direction. They didn't want you to know where you belong. Something about the new moon. Somebody did something in private on the new moon. They try to slow you down. They've been doing this for a lot of cycles. Six, six. The beast. Yeah, the fucking devil. A Capricorn or a devil or something like that. Capricorn. That's all about 
Oh, uh, that's the tenth house, right? That's all about like your career, your um success. So that's what they were trying to do. And somebody thought it was funny. Yeah, because they thought they hey, it brought them some type of satisfaction. When they thought they were separating you from a contract. Somebody in this spell. Somebody wanted to be out of work. So they were trying to separate you from your job, your career. Uh, yeah, some type of status or something. Well, leadership status. What is wrong with people? Who got time? I, and evidently, somebody don't believe in karma, right? Because somebody ass is getting karma. Was paid to commit a crime. An Aries or on an Aries. Yeah. Was paid to commit a crime. An Aries. On an Aries or on your first house. Something about your self-image, your personality, your ambition, your drives, and your body. So, something about your drive and your ambition... Your determination. Uh, look, yeah, they try to put you in solitary confinement. I told you, somebody tried to, like, isolate you. Because they didn't want somebody to see, like, the beauty in you. They didn't want you to fully uh, immerse yourself into mm -hmm. you. And they didn't want you to, to develop your personality. They wanted you to have, like, developmental issues. Like I said, somebody was trying to cause a lot of developmental issues when it comes to you developing uh, your career, your platform, your whatever it is that you're trying to work on. Because somebody's trying to block everything you do. Somebody's just mad because you're beautiful. You hear me? You're just a beautiful soul. This don't even have to be like physical beauty. It's just you got that beautiful energy and somebody's just a fucking hater. Do you hear me? Somebody failed to take the opportunity to right their wrongs. Take the high road in reverse. They didn't, uh, look, they didn't take the high road. I told you it's a Capricorn. A Capricorn or the fucking devil, y'all. Your public image. Your career. Your profession. Your ambitions. Or your association to your father. This devil don't like that you are connected to the most high. You hear me? Because they, they, whoever these devils are. Because they got some little agents here in human form helping them try to block and stop something, honey. But uh, it's not working. These devils are mad. Did you still find your life purpose? They trying to figure out how the hell did you find out your life purpose? There could be some envious men here. It's a lot of uh, distorted energy, though. Yeah. Property manager. They thought that you were their fucking property. I'm telling you, whatever this group is, it's like a group of men is what I'm getting, though. But I remember I did a reading, like, probably about a year and a half ago. This could even be, like, women acting as if they're men is what i'm getting i did a reading probably like a year and a half ago on my old channel i was like it's a whole bunch of different women coming towards somebody it's a whole bunch of different women I, i'm getting like different races different you know creeds whatever you want to call it it's a whole bunch of women that's distorted this is a fucking woman here they they're trying to act like their faces they're trying to cloak themselves as men is what i'm getting they coming toward, I was saying that they were coming towards somebody acting as if they wanted to, you know, collab or whatever. But it was, it was some bad energy behind it. Yeah, because somebody was lying and pretending and you seen they asked for who the hell they are. Yeah, return to Cinder. Whatever they sent to you, return to Cinder times 10. Yeah, them women, they were trying to set somebody up. They wanted you to remain silent. They were trying to set you up acting like that they wanted to be your friend. Look, how we ops, you see me, you don't say shit. Yeah, they really your ops. Like I said, they working for whoever they working for. And they were trying to set you up acting like they were your friend. But y'all are really ops. And how y'all ops and you don't, they don't say shit. They closed. You hear me? They think you can't see them. We got Virgo here. So it could be a Capricorn, a Virgo, and an Aries involved. Traumatizing in reverse. Your job. I'm telling you, it's about your job and your responsibilities. Yeah, Virgo. Somebody see that you your ability to cope in the face of adversity. Oh. They like, what the hell? We shouldn't have went against that person. We should have put them on our roster. You hear me? 
We could have been superstars together. Somebody see you as a star. Yep. And Im immortal. Mm-hmm. See it, touch it, obtain it. Make your mental health a priority. Like I said, you could have made your mental health a priority. Somebody else needs to make their mental health a priority. Somebody wanted you to be mentally just unstable. Somebody wanted you to have developmental issues or they saying that. Somebody could have like a ADHD too as well. Um, somebody watched like a lot of uh, true crime TV. Somebody thought that you would have been blacking out by now. Amulet of Amulet for protection. Good luck. Charm. Whatever. Boom. That's in reverse. Uh, what did I say? The devil's shoestring? Devil's shoestring could be what somebody was trying to use to protect themselves or to bring in some type of good luck and fortune. But, or whatever amulet they're using. It's not protect. They don't have protection and they don't have good luck and fortune. They Like I said, somebody's getting tripped up. They're getting tripped up. They're using a they devil's shoestring shit. The, the goats. The goat's rule. I told this is Capricorn. Goat's rule. Goat's rule. I don't know, honey. Goat's. The rule. Whatever it is. So this is what somebody is using. This is what somebody need to use, though, for protection. Somebody, but for well, somebody, it's not working. It's not working no more. Somebody's short on money. Somebody don't have enough money. So I think Devil Shoe Strength can use that for your money or some shit, too. Intruder in reverse. Yeah. Somebody need to get some devil shoe strength. Because these negative energies are invading your space, your house. Intruder. It'll knock out these intruders. You hear me? They didn't fuck with you back then. Now they're talking about tap in. Didn't I tell y'all? I did a read about a year and a half ago. These bitches didn't fuck with whoever the reading was about. But now they talking about they should have tapped in with you. Because they see it as you are a star. You are a spiritual leader. You are who you say you are. You're not pretending. You're not lying. You're not dangerous. Or none of that. You know. Someone gave you an item that was cursed. They broke all the rules. Pisces. 12th house. Your inner self. Dreams. Somebody tried to give you something that was cursed in your dreams in secret. In the past. You know, I say something about your subconscious. Yeah, they're getting karma now. These hidden enemies. Mm-hmm. They're getting karma. For somebody, it's somebody's last name is, um, uh, it's, if, like, if you adopted or your mom married to someone or you married somebody, their last name is cursed. Memory. Somebody... Like, how you got your memory? Because they thought that, uh, honey, they placed some type of fear onto you and you would miss out. You hear me? Yeah. Because they wanted you to avoid the truth. And they asked for avoiding the truth. After the storm, the sun was shining again. You hear me? They tried to cause a time moment. But guess what? Everything is going to be illuminated because after the storm, the sun was shining again. You hear me? Yeah. Somebody was addicted. Trying to come in between your relationships with whoever. Yeah. Uh, you are, you, oh, wait a minute, you have a lot of superpowers here. Somebody know that. And you getting downloads in your dreams. Somebody try to stop that. Didn't I say something about your dreams? They're trying to block your dreams. So your the downloads in your dreams. They That's what they wanted too. They wanted that ability. Yeah, that's your superpower here. But, um... Yeah, they were trying to stop that. So that's why they were doing a lot of crown chakra work. To try to make you uh, be a maniac. Or if somebody says you were a maniac, says you were dangerous. You're not. It came out twice. Dangerous or make whatever. Twice. Reputation. They try to, um, you know, tarnish your reputation. I might try to say you had a, a reputation of being like a maniac. But I'm hearing a manic 
depressed, manic depressive. Oh, that's what they try to do, honey. Yeah. PayPal cash app in reverse. Then I tell you, somebody money. Somebody money funny. Somebody try to, somebody playing with your cash app and your PayPal. They're trying to block it. You don't want your money, honey. They're they doing some, they could have tied something up with a shoestring or some shit, rope. Very combative. Refusing to admit any wrongs here about them trying to stop you from blossoming and blooming. Hmm. But you are going to live a good life, long term, you hear me? And these karmics are wasting their damn time, trying to gaslight you, thinking they going to run you, but they can't. So they could use you up, because soon, it's in reverse, they're not going to use shit up. What you can expect from this new connection? What you, wait a minute. Always read something backwards. What you can't expect from this new connection? Yeah, all right. Well, I don't know why. I feel like something was backwards. Somebody was reading something backwards. So they were reading you backwards, or they could have had you read the shit backwards. I don't know, honey. Yeah, they was trying to confuse you. Thrives off of being in drama. They were trying to confuse you. Damn. Wow. No more of them. F them folks, you hear me? Fuck them people, collective. Fuck them spiritual haters. But they swear they spiritual. Some of them spiritual, some of them religious. Some of them, you know how it is. Screenshots getting evidence proof facts. What they getting facts trying to get proof of hell? Your romantic love of hell. Trying to see if your passion. So somebody's trying to stop like your sensuality and your sexuality and all that. They don't want you to do shit. You got dusted off. So somebody got proof, evidence. Somebody was getting a lot of evidence. They got screenshots proof. Did you dust something off? Did they sent your damn way? Yeah, because somebody been watching you like on their phone or online or whatever. Yeah, you dust it off like that shit wasn't shit. It ain't shit. <laughs> Looking you up. Drama starter. Yeah, but you too busy winning. So they trying to kiss ass with they happiness hating ass. This runner from the past. The same shit, just a different day. You hear me? Just trying to run from um they're trying to run from their pace. Trying to see if you're doing the same shit. Yeah, but you ran from this happiness hater that's still stuck in the past. That's doing the same shit just a different day. They ain't shit. And they know they ain't shit and they ain't gonna be shit. Excuse me. Yeah, I ain't putting it on nobody, but they know. That's why they too busy invested in your life. Because if you was gonna be something, why would you be invested in somebody else's life like that? Who got that energy? Yeah, looking you up and shit. Because they ain't shit and they doing the same shit. So the people you left behind, they still right where they, where you left them at. You hear me? Yeah, stalker. We got stalkers here all in their head. Stop all in their head about money. <laughs> dreaming. They dreaming about them to stop. Oh, they all in their head because they know they stuck. Yeah, look, with they creeping A's. Creeping A's. They stuck and you're not, you're not stuck. They wasting their time. It already came out wasting time. The karmics, they wasting time. Stuck, no changes, limited. That's how they, did I say they looking you up trying to see if you stuck because they had stuck in the past. But you ain't. You hear me? You done changed. It's no, no limits to your abilities or your talents or whatever it is. You hear me? You're not limited. Yeah, somebody's hooked on the queen rising. Mm -hmm, somebody got an issue with the queen rising. <laughs> they try to say. The, oh. Let me hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Let me go back, let me go back. All right. Something's being taken from somebody. It's being repo. 
So whatever they took from you, I don't give a care if it was your sexuality, your sensuality, your energy, your time, whatever. It's being taken back from their ass. Yeah, they were hooked on you. Try to. They may have stolen a little bit. They stole a little bit. Yeah, they were hooked on the clean. Clean, okay? Something is cleaned out. You hear me? Yeah. That's being repo. Whatever hook or attachment, whatever energy harvesting, ciphering energy they were doing to you. It's going to come back to you because you stepped into your power. Yeah. And they were fake flexing. The third party. Yeah, and you moving the hell on. You hear me? No thanks. You moving on from their ass. Mm -hmm. They were fake flexing off of your energy. That's the only reason why they were getting money. I told you somebody's money. So they had some type of shoestring. They could have been using devil shoestring. Trying to uh, attach themselves to your money. Tie your money up. Trip you up or something. And they thought they were going to get some money or something. Because somebody's threatened by you. Very intimidated by you. And they bothered with their hating ass. And they want to fight. They raised war against you. Competing with you. Yeah, you up here. Look, sipping on your tea. Chilling. You hear me? Unfazed with these upsets. Uh, toxic ass karmics. Yeah. You rejected their offer here. So guess what they want to do? <laughs> Steal your ideas, copy your work, duplicate whatever you're doing. And what I say they've been doing, feeding off of you, fake flexing. Yeah, they were real, really into you when you're, with your positive ass, huggy. Great chemistry, great vibes. Mm-hmm. And the boss daddy. The uh, I guess whoever been, whoever got kicked out of the group spiritually, the, whoever I don't know, he watching your ways. He watching your ways. Look from a fake account on social media, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, YouTube, Reddit, whatever, <laughs> Snapchat. He watching everywhere, everywhere you go or whatever you do. If he not watch, he got somebody watching your ways. That romantic love affair, six feet, secret lover. Yeah, this person been reflecting about an impersonating forcer here. Yeah, that wants to be you, acting like you, look like you, copying you, forcing things on the boss daddy, I guess. Trying to force their way in. Use this force to get what they want. This is what the boss daddy was doing, but that's what somebody's doing to the boss daddy. The boss daddy thought he was going to force his way into your life, too, or some shit. Yeah, Somebody was spending a lot of money on somebody. Or giving somebody a lot of money. Or maybe this boss daddy was getting money off of you. I don't know. But it's like they need some type of sex fix so they can move on. Or it, But you moved on from this. And you could be doing ref some reflecting. Yeah, somebody's... Somebody paid for a love spell, too. So, I guess, like, whatever you're passionate about, the love spell was supposed to stop you, your passion, your sex, whatever, okay? Um, yeah, didn't I tell you something about your reputation? They're trying to make you say, you know, saying that you had a bad reputation, but you don't. So, ignore them cyber bullies or whatever. Yeah, you're ignoring their ass. The cyber, cyber bully married for money, like I said. Um... Yeah, I don't know if this boss daddy trying to marry you for money or somebody married the boss daddy for money. But somebody paid for a love spill here too. Somebody, we got moving. Somebody trying to move whatever they spell work. They did. They're trying to move it. Hide it or some shit. They're reflecting. Somebody can't find it. They don't know what they did with it or 
how they did something. Somebody trying to pay for somebody to do it over. Mm-hmm. Yeah, wow. Look, when you meditating or somebody's meditating on your energy, trying to force their way into your energy, this impersonator. Yeah, scarcity tactics. I told you they're trying to tie up your money or some shit. Trying to force, like, I guess I like project some shit. That you're false or I don't know. Yeah, but whatever game that they were playing, that shit didn't work. This shit backfired. Yeah, because you don't have a bad reputation. They tried to say that you were. you want what they want use this force to get what they want yeah somebody like meditates on somebody's energy or some shit so that's how they were getting what they want I told you they were using your energy to be abundant to get money sexual something about like your sexual energy or something like that I don't know honey so if you feel like passionate less or uh Sick, like something wrong with your sex drag. That's because somebody was siphoning your energy. Yeah, this impersonator. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but you you don't broke free from some shit. Yeah, traveling. You moving on. Yeah, unbothered. Cause that shit played out. Come through spirit. Somebody going bankrupt now. Yeah. Because you distanced yourself from them. You hear me? You distanced yourself. Yeah, from this wolf in sheep's clothing. It was just lying, honey. Wolf in sheep's clothing. Just thought they were going to get some type of money. Inheritance. Some type of unexpected income. So somebody tried to meditate on your energy to get your inheritance or just some type of unexpected income. It's being given to you. It's going to be like a just a blessing from God. Take it how it resonates. So if somebody was digging up dirt, looking for dirt on you, or vice versa. So if somebody was digging up dirt on you, trying to block you from getting some type of inheritance, digging up dirt. This could even be like, um, you know, these are demons, agents. So they're trying to find a doorway, you know. There's a, I'm here. You hear me knocking? Let me in. You know, a doorway to, um, a, you know, allow them in to your energy. Yeah, because meditation, they couldn't get in there. Like I said that the other day that like I seen somebody meditating, but it's like dark figures running around trying to get in your energy, but you had like this bubble over you, like a dome covered over you, you know, like a protective shield. Oh, go back to that. Somebody's trying to break your protection. Yeah, with that amulet. There you go. Somebody trying to break your protection. Yeah. So they could have um, your good luck. Somebody, but whoever this person is, they're not protected and they don't have good luck no more. But that's what they were trying to project that energy onto you or get into your energy field. And the same shit, different day. That's what they do. Look you up. Mm-hmm. Mm-mm. What's just what man? I'm seeing Megan Stay. You say mm-mm. Something, something before you brush your teeth. What's she say? You you come worry about me before you brush your teeth. Mm-mm. Something. I can't even, but that's what I'm hearing. <laughs> yeah. Somebody is that worried about you. Wow. Like somebody grabbed their phone or check your Whatever you got going on before they even attend to their daily duties. You hear me? Yeah, but yeah, we're going to end it right there, y'all. Y'all look down. Look what it say. Cheers to the good times. We're going to end it right there. You hear me? That is awesome. Cheers to the good times for you, Collective. Because all this is over is what I'm getting. Yeah, you guys. I'm going to leave it right there. You guys, I'm going to love your life.